Most machine shops have access to the same equipment. It comes down to the machinist and his knowledge of the machine and his knowledge of the process. And in that area, Roberts is uniquely strong. Our attitude is to provide the best possible product we can to our customer. The difference is our attitude. Their attitude. Positive attitude is something that you can't train. Oh, their attitude is everything. At Roberts, we have three areas of machining. We've got our CNC department, we've got our Swiss department, CNC Swiss, and then we have screw machines. In a house that can provide you with tighter than normal tolerance on harder machine materials, that's going to provide you with significant value added product. At Roberts, we like to try to be a low maintenance supplier. That means we deliver on time, we, we deliver quality parts, we help solve problems. The buyers don't have to worry about us. We are a precision shop. We live in the tighter tolerance world. Customers want the best possible product. We're constantly looking at ways to take cost out and become more efficient. There are a number of uh, operations that we do where we drop the part complete. Matter of fact, the majority of our work is there, but oftentimes, we can blank a part on a machine that has a lower rate and then finish it on a more expensive machine. So you're going to do 90% of your work on a less expensive machine and then 10% of your work finishing it. What makes us competitive is our flexibility. We work very hard at meeting the customer expectations and uh, providing them a, a quality part for a good fair price. Tooling is elementally important. It is how the part is made. We have our own tool room and we invest heavily in it and the people who run the tool room. Tool rooms usually are for tool sharpening. Here at Roberts we make tooling, uh, step drills, end mills, profile tools, any kind of specialty tooling that you can't normally buy off the shelf. So it is one of our advantages here at Roberts that sets us apart from the others. We can make a tool in a half a day, uh, we can be creative, the tool maker can work with our machinists to solve problems, and if our customers make a change, we can respond almost instantaneously to that. Tolerances that we hold here are anywhere from plus or minus one thousandths to up to plus or minus ten thousandths. If there have to be a change in tolerancing that would allow it to go to a more efficient machine, say from a CNC to a screw machine, which is a faster machine and therefore a more efficient machine, we can do that too. Well, we have found that being neat, clean and organized allows us to you know, concentrate on making the parts. Our, our goal is to provide our customers the best value. There's a difference between price and total cost of acquisition. You're looking for total cost of acquisition. So that's a combination of quality, precision, delivery, and engineering support. If you get an outstanding price, but the part is out of spec, or it's late, or it's out of the wrong material, then you haven't saved any money at all. As a matter of fact, you're gonna spend a lot more chasing price. A lot of our machines have been modified from how we first bought them. Uh, we have some very skilled and very creative people here. Anybody can buy the machine that we have here. And what we do that's special is we have the ability to modify the machines or make special attachments. Uh, we've done things where we put high pressure coolant on the machine. We like to tweak, you're right, yeah. So when we tweak the machines, we cycle time, reduction in cycle time. We also make special attachments where we can increase the uh, tooling life. So in the end, it's a big benefit for the customer. Anything we can do to save seconds, seconds really matter in this business. It puts us more in direct competition with the low prices of China overseas. You may have heard the term feeds and speeds. The more quickly the part is processed, and that gives you a lower cost. The current machine behind me right now is a 750,000 piece order on that, which we run in 2.2 seconds. On an order that big, if you shave a tenth of a second off, it's really quick to add up the dollars, and that's cost savings not only for us, but also for our customers. It is generally true that the more you handle a part, the more it's going to cost, but it's not universally true. There are times when you'll handle a part twice in order to reduce the cost because the first machine you're running it on has a lower machine rate or it might be a more depreciated machine, and you'll do the majority of the rough work there, and then you'll finish it on a more precise machine, but spend less time on that machine, and you'll get a better overall value and a better price. Uh, this machine here, we call it the 
um, Robo Haas and what it allows us to do is have the robot arm load and unload the part so you never have to open the machine up. At Roberts we have three areas of machining. We have at our CNC department where we run mostly Mazak multiplexes which are turn mill centers. Then we have our Swiss department we run Citizen and Sagami machines up to 32 millimeters. We recently acquired a new one. We have another one on order. And then in our screw machine department, we go up to two and five eighths inch diameter, which is pretty big in the screw machine world. And we go from one spindle up to eight. There's no single element in making a great part. It's a collective of many elements combining into one to provide an outstanding process, generating an outstanding part. And that's what you can expect from Robert's Automatic. We feel that we have some of the best machinists in the business. Um, not only machinists, but the other indirect people that work here. Some of them have been here, have been here 20, 30, close to 40 years. Um, I've been here 30 years myself. I've been uh, working here now for going on almost 30 years. I started here 38 years ago. About 28 years, and uh, I'm not really one of the senior people here. <laughs> if I were to provide any advice, it would be to contact your shop early preferably during the design process, we'll look at a print, do an analysis, and figure out the best way for this part to run based on your tolerancing and material callout. That can include the machine type, that can include the tooling type, that can include how we manufacture the tools, and that includes how we program our machines. Roberts Automatic Products is ISO 9001-2008. We're also a MinSharp facility for safety. ITAR registered. We also have redundant capabilities. So we have several machines that can do the same job. So if you run into a problem with the line chew or if you run into a problem with other elements of it, we'll simply move that part to a different machine to complete it on time. We accept responsibility for plating and grinding and other secondary operations, although we may not do them ourselves, but we have several quality companies in our area that we have long-term relationships with that will provide those services to us. I'm Andy, and I have the attitude. I'm Gary, and I have the attitude. We have the attitude. I'm Dale, and I have that attitude.